head of that bone right there poking out against the skin from the inside and when the shoe pushes back against it from the outside the skin gets stuck in between these two pressure points and it will thicken and right where you see the little core in the center that is the actual most prominent little teeny point of bone that's pushing out and that makes the skin just a little bit thicker right there and then all of the other skin around it will become thick but not quite as thick and that's what makes that core. The core is not something that you can get rid of or take out and get rid of the corn. The problem really is from the bone pushing underneath due to the shape and the position of that toe. So the question is, once this corn or callus is trimmed, what can we do to protect that area? Well, you can get shoes that are wider, shoes that don't press on that area. Uh, you could go barefoot for the rest of your life, which I don't think is a possibility for most of us. Um, and there's different ways that you can pad the area to help keep the pressure off. Ultimately, we can surgically remove that bony prominence that sits underneath and that will change the shape of the toe a little bit and get rid of the pressure points. So this uh, is an example of what we do when a patient comes in for regular maintenance to help keep these more comfortable. The next patient you'll see is one who actually developed a sore underneath the corn because the corn got too thick. And right here I'm just pressing so that she can see if it feels better or if I need to do a little bit more. Okay. So just to recap, last week when you were here and we trimmed this callus down, mm -hmm. there was an open sore underneath the little corn here, right? right? Mm -hmm. Okay. And it was really painful, much more so than usual. Oh. Right? For you. Okay. And so how has it been since we kind of trimmed it? And how did you like that bandage that was on there? I thought it was great. Thank you. You did that. <laughs> yeah. You wanted, you wanted to be okay. praised. Yeah. So we've been putting a little antibiotic with a Band-Aid on this exactly. um, every day. Everything. And it's, it looks healed. I don't see oh. any more open sore. But oh. that's the danger of letting those corns get too thick. So. Um, we don't need to put any more antibiotic or band-aid on it, but we will um, Let's look at what kind of pad you can put on it so it doesn't happen again. Oh, okay so, Yeah, do you ever do you ever put a little corn pad or something on it? I, I think vaguely I, I remember a couple of times, but it was so bad. I okay. Did. All right So what I'm gonna do is I'll give you a handful of these and these have a little pre-cut hole in them okay all right and what you do is you put the sore spot right in that hole oh and what that does is it allows the shoe pressure to be taken up around that pressure point instead of right on it oh thank okay you. so these these are real thin ones mm -hmm. so it won't take up too much room in your shoe okay and i'll give you a handful of these to start with and when i see you back in a couple months for your regular routine care mm -hmm. we can talk about whether this worked or it didn't okay oh thank you and so wait, much. let me ask them now what if that what if something happens between now and a couple of months well you don't wait then if uh, something if something gets very painful, I will. you come in sooner. Okay. okay. The two month time frame is only for what Medicare calls routine trimming okay. of toenails, corns, and calluses. Okay. So you drop something on your foot, you get an ingrown toenail, or this starts to hurt a lot. You don't wait. You come in sooner than that. Okay. okay. I will remember that. Okay. This video serves as a great reminder that it's important to have elegant, beautiful nails and to take care of your nails. So treat yourself to a seven piece manicure set like this. This beautiful gold kit comes with two nail clippers, trimmers, multi-purpose scissors, an ear pick, a cuticle trimmer, an eyebrow tweezer, and one acne needle. There's an Amazon link below to the kit that's highly recommended by this YouTube channel. 
Go ahead and check it out and treat yourself to beautiful nails today. Hey folks, you spoke and we listened. Here's what you had to say about Meta 7. I love it so much. It gives me so much energy during the day. I've noticed a change in my hair, my nails, my blood pressure. There's no doubt that it, it's, it's a benefit to me. It gives me more stamina. And it could actually help you lose weight. Now, I haven't taken a nap in six months. That's right, Meta 7. More and more people are sending in their testimonials. Weight loss, more energy, and generally feeling more alert during the day. Let's hear more. I used it to help wean myself off caffeine and energy drinks, and my productivity has been very high lately. It's natural, it's amazing. I feel motivated to get out and do things that I didn't before. I'm not tired during the day. I've worked 12 hour shifts. Just go, go, go all day. It makes me feel great, I love it, and um, take it. It's wonderful stuff. If you haven't tried Meta7 yet, it's time to order yours from Amazon. Time to boost your metabolism and kick your energy level into high gear. There's an Amazon link in the description.